Smell that? It's time for a swing dance reaction video. No. 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 Yeah! Alright guys, ah, feeling a little better, this uh, echinacea tea, it's really helping, I'm not feeling good today, but that won't stop me from doing another reaction video. Welcome to Street Smart Swing folks, my name is Jamin Jackson, also known as the Galactic Swing Dance Umpire, and I am excited to see the conclusion of this review. This competition was very controversial to me because the, the people I had picked to get to the finals did not get there. For whatever reason, they didn't you know, easily get picked. So I'm going to be curious to see who actually made the finals in this. And then I'm going to give you my opinion on who I think should win this competition. I'm a professional dancer, but I'm also a judge, so I like to talk about it and put my opinion out there so you guys can know what my perspective is, so when you are dancing, you at least have an understanding of what I look for. So let's get right into it. And here we go. All right, let's get her done. This is it. That's right, it's time for some math, folks. Can't, can't botch it now, you've come so far. All right, great, so looks like the couple I like made it to the finals. Nice, nice! Gustav and Laia. Yes, I like that! Nice. Velma and Victor. Okay, <laughs> okay. Okay. All right, Florent. Yeah. Okay, good stop. <clears throat> okay. Everybody. Okay. One round. Yes. They're going to keep modulating. <laughs> All right. Yes! Okay. Okay! That was a surprise to me because I did not expect them to have just one round. I kind of like that. I was just straight to the point. It's like, hey, we ain't got all night. Show us what you can do. 
And uh, it looked like the Champions Cup allowed for some choreography. So I cannot penalize them for doing some choreography. That's the format of the competition. So for those who came prepared and nailed their choreography, I've got to acknowledge that. I've also got to acknowledge their control, which is the social dance part, right? They probably can lead a swing out, but they probably had one choreographed in their set too, many of the dancers. That's okay. This is the Champions Cup. So I'm not going to glorify social dancing and all that in this particular competition. They can do choreography too. So my winner by a blowout, they said definitively that they wanted to win. And in my book, they won. This is the first couple. Uh, Melanie and Jeremy, whoo, they came prepared, they executed, they had choreography, and they had social dance. I can even tell you I didn't like some of the arrangements of the shapes they used. I felt it was too much Charleston, just a little bit too much. They could have took out one of those phrases, a little Charleston touch, the little toe touch. Just If they just took one of those out, it would have really been a blowout for me. But... With that even being said, they still crushed it. They delivered. I was wowed. I'm part of the audience. Plus, I'm a dancer and a judge. And they had the full package. Control, they had timing, they had creativity, and they showed it in the most pithy way. One set. Boom. They walked out and dropped some shoes, right? Now, with that being said, my second place went to Florent and his partner. They didn't do anything super flashy in this one, but I felt their social dancing was solid and it was tight. It was super tight. Same as Gustav and Laia, they, the, they would be third for me. They had some fantastic ways of like doing some Charleston syncopations, moving around each other, and then going back into side and side by side airplanes type stuff. I like that. I think it was a little rusty uh, on some of those transitions trying to execute it. Um, and that's just the way it is because sometimes the choreography just flows so well um, when you work on it. And then when it's time to nail it, sometimes it's like you get the nervous jitters and then it just kind of comes apart some way. And even when the dancers are good at social dancing, when they go into choreography, it's a different mindset. Like you both know what's going to happen. And so you can kind of see that jarring nature of someone doing social dance and then they immediately go into, oh, snap, we got to choreograph our thing and make sure we nail it on time. I still like their sets. I still thought it was creative. It was a little rusty and it was still worth third place. <clears throat> Those are my top three. Melanie and Journey, uh, a Jeremy for me, blowout. It was awesome. It was awesome. Florent. Gustav Laya. So what do you guys think about that? That's my opinion. I think that was a great competition. I'm happy to see the couple I thought that should have been in the finals in the finals. That really made me upset because like what are we if we're not judging some type of creativity with the ability to do something that is traditional? What are we judging? Are we just judging something that's traditional? Are we trying to push the level up a little bit? Let's bring some creativity for the future generations. So I'm happy at the result. I can relax. I can go watch a Disney movie now, right? <clears throat> okay. What do you guys think? Who do you think should have won this competition? Let me know in the comments section. I was thoroughly satisfied by that competition and I can't wait to see the next one. Um, if I don't see you in class or one of my free courses online, I will see you in the next reaction video. Let me know who you thought should have won. Take care.